Howdy y'all, Lone Star Riley here. I've got a new product, a video camera, the DJI Action 3. Y'all guys stick around. Lone Star Rider on his motorcycle. Guys, I'm glad you stuck around. The DJI Action 3 is uh, supposed to be a really, really nice camera. And I've owned the DJI Action for a good two or three years now. Um, and I love that camera. So I'm sure I'll love this one just as much. And I'm going to show you what's inside here. I don't do very many uh, unboxings, so... Uh, this one is the Adventure Combo. So it comes. All right, here is the box. This is how it was shipped to me. It has a little bit of instruction. Yeah, there's a, they don't look like they're fully charged, but there's three batteries in here. And there's a USB-C uh, charging port to charge all those. A uh, little button net there to indicate what's charged and what's not. And I think it goes from one battery to the next battery to the next battery. And, uh, the next we have the camera here. And it looks pretty much like the old camera, which I'll get out here in just a little bit. And we can kind of compare the two. But And it says Action 3 on there. So pretty darn cool. You got a uh, back screen and you have a front screen, <clears throat> which they were doing this before GoPro started that. But this is now a touch screen also on the front, which I think is might be pretty handy. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure this is the, the case that goes around. Uh, we're doing portrait mode and some other stuff. Here's the outside case uh, to do portrait modes. There's the uh, mounts on the bottom, which are magnetic, by the way. And there's two of these that come with it. And they also have in here this uh, mount. And I think it's kind of like a sticky mount type thing. So we'll see that. And the, uh, the camera comes with a rubber ring around it now the old one doesn't have that and there's an extra rubber ring in there i guess in case you lose that one <clears throat> and you got two thumb screws that come with this let's see what we got in here this looks like the uh the selfie stick that comes with it it has a uh, threads on the bottom to do a tripod I'm gonna go get the camera and do a comparison on that. So that's all that comes in the box. All right, guys. This is the Osmo Action 1, and this is Osmo Action 3. I never did buy an Osmo Action 2, and I really love this little camera. <clears throat> Here's uh, some differences in it. Uh, it is slightly a little thicker. Not much. Oh, let's compare it over here. Yeah, a little bit thicker. It's definitely bigger. It's longer here. And it's just a tad taller. And uh, the battery, to change it out, is on the bottom here. And then you have your quick switch button and your memory card and your USB-C to charge it. There are no doors on this side except for to unlock the uh, battery to pull it out. Anyway, I love this thing. It worked really, really good. Um, I've had it for about, I'd say about three years, three and a half years, somewhere around in there. I bought this off of Amazon when my other two cameras were stolen. And no, they weren't stolen at the same time. One was stolen off the top of my trailer where I normally keep the GoPro at to do recordings. 
And the other one was a GoPro um, session. It was one of the small ones, which was given to me. And it was stolen off of a table that I was eating at that I went over to get the napkins and forks and it just disappeared. Lesson learned. Um, with the insurance money, I got a new camera, which was this camera. And I also got the Osmo Pocket, um, which is a handheld with a gimbal on it. I'll throw a picture up of it here. And I still use that one. Rocksteady is really, really good on this. Uh, there's three mics on this thing. There's a really, really cool connection with this now. Oh boy. It only can go in one way. You know magnets. You got this, which isn't going to come off until you tell it to come off. I like this a lot. I even bought a third party connection here. Very cool. That happens to be a magnet. <clears throat> so anyway, the new mount system I really like a lot, which they have on the Osmo Action 2. If you notice on the top, there's only one button. This is the power button and the record and stop. This is record and stop. This button went to the side. It is also the quick switch, which is very cool. Um, the quick switch on this one is right there. But they doubled this to a uh, power on and power off and the quick switch, which works pretty cool. Um, if I cut it on by holding the power button, you can switch through, so you can do a quick switch to something else. Yeah, I set five different uh, custom um, settings in there, <clears throat> which you could do on this one too. Uh, this also has a horizon lock and a, a couple other things that this one does not have. Uh, and also it will record in portrait mode. So if you like to do TikTok or Instagram or, you know, shorts, YouTube shorts, uh, very, very cool. And then uh, the menu choices on here is pretty much the same too. All this stuff here is pretty much the same. Uh, oh, the other thing is that this front screen now is touch. You can do stuff on here and change things on the front if you want to. Now, you're saying, well, why don't you have a uh, GoPro, Rex? Well, ever since I've been using the DJI Action 1, number one, it was cheaper. Number two, this is cheaper than a GoPro. I did get the DJI Osmo Action Adventure Combo, which cost a little bit more, but it came with a really, 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 really cool. The Action Combo came with this really cool charging case. It's a USB-C, and you can charge three batteries in there, but it, it'll go from the first, charge it, next to next, and you can get an 80% charge within an hour which is really darn cool too. So this case rocks. The action combo also came with this very cool selfie stick, which is really tall. Yeah. Anyhow, um, yeah, it came with this and it came with two of these and one of those and one of these and that 
that's it. That's all it came with. Some instructions and stuff like that. This little Osmo One, I used this aluminum cage from Small Rig. It used to be black. The sun bleached it out. And I used this cage to protect this camera. I was going to turn it into a vlog camera, but I never did take it off the trailer. I always left it on the trailer. Yeah, you can see the original color. <laughs> um, I don't know if they're going to come up with a cage for the Action 3. But I will be getting the DJI mic, wireless mics, and they just plug directly into here, which is really cool. It goes right into the slot right there. And then the other side is the batteries. And the SD card slot is right there. All right. With having the uh, Osmo Action 1 and now the Osmo Action 3, I also have the Osmo Pocket 2, which I talked about. And I also have the DJI um, Maverick Mini 2. So you might call me a DJI fanboy, but I like their stuff. Good high quality, good warranties. They take care of you. Um, yeah, I like DJI. <laughs> so, if you're going to consider an action camera, uh, I think this one here costs three forty nine or somewhere around there. Unless you get the the kit, which adds another hundred dollars to it. Um, it's a camera well worth getting. And the big reason I got the action kit was to get this charging case. I think this rocks. Uh, really do. All right, guys, I'm uh, done jabbering. Just had to tell you about the cool camera. It's very cool. All right, guys, I'm out of here. This is it. I'm done. Catch y'all on the road with the DJI Action 3. Osmo Action 3. Yeah. Awesome camera. DJI Osmo Action 1. Awesome camera. Yes, I will continue to use this even though I'm going to be using this too. Did I already say catch you on the road? Get out of here. I thought you were on the phone. No, just doing a video. Just have to make sure it's snapped in pretty good. And it has a thread on the bottom to do a tr tripod pot on, to do a, it has a,